Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video tutorial we are going to learn about image tag in HTML. So let's start. So I have created this file list.html so which is empty and I have given this title image tag. Now I have added this Ronaldo image into uh, this uh, HTML folder that we have created in our past tutorial and now I will access this uh, image and our HTML file. So for that I will come here and we will use the image tag. So I'll use image. So if you close an image tag or doesn't close it, so it doesn't matter. So I'll use this tag, ending tag, and now here I can use the source. Now the source is the uh, the path if you are uh, uh, accessing the uh, image from another place then you have provided the path here but here we are we have this list.html and ronaldo.jpg at the same level so that is why we will only provide the uh, image name so here i will provide ronaldo dot jpg as it is showing up so now i'll control s it and now i'll go live you can see that the image is shown but it is too big to show on the screen so we will provide uh, we will apply some properties on this so for that i will come here to this image tag and first we will provide the width property so i'll uh, make the width 200 pixel so i'll control it said so why we are using here pixel because the screen of the computers as well as mobile phones are uh, mired in in pixels so that is why we are using pixel because these websites are used uh, on mobile phones or on computers so now i'll go here and now if i refresh this now you can see the image so we will go again to our uh, visual studio code and now i will provide the height property so height if i click here height equals double quotes and if i make this 500 and now if i control s it now if i go here and uh, refresh this now you can see that the height is increased to 500 but as you can see it uh, is uh, stretched now so we only provide the height or the width and the other property it automatically adjusts so if i remove this width now if i control s it and now if i go and refresh this now you can see that the, it is automatically adjusted now i can add also a title with it or a text with it so for that i will come here to the top or to the bottom and here i will use uh, h1 and i'll use uh, ronaldo image and now i'll control s it now if i control s it and now if i go here and uh, refresh this again now you can see the ronaldo image is shown here now we have some other properties as well in this so for that i'll come here now we have alt property which means alternative so alt so we can use text here so i'll use ronaldo image so what uh, why we use this alt property so this is used when uh, for example if i have a slow internet connection and the uh, image loading time is taking too much uh, time so then it is uh, shown it is showing show this text to the user that it is the image of ronaldo so now if i control s it and now if i go and refresh this so it is a local image so it is not showing up mm. But if it is uh, uh, an, an, an image from the internet and the internet connection is very slow, so it will show that text instead of the image until the image is loaded. Now, I'll come again and we have another property called title. 
So if I go out of this, make a space here, space here, and now if I use title, and now if I use here, Ronaldo image, now if I go and refresh this um, page, and now if I hover over this, now you can see that the Ronaldo image label is shown here. So where we use this title, so now we when we uh, uh, show a product in the website on our website and people don't know, know about uh, the product so we use a small title of that product so uh, when people hover over it so they can understand what is that product so this was image tag in uh, html i think I hope you like the video. If you like the video, please like, subscribe and comment. Thank you.